Hello. Today, we are going to be making a batch of delicious mini lemon cakes, which will top off with a creamy citrus frosting. Here's what you'll need to make this recipe. For the cupcakes, you will need three and a half cups of flour, one teaspoon baking soda, one half teaspoon baking powder, one half teaspoon salt, one cup of softened butter or margarine, two cups of wholesome sweeteners or organic sugar, three eggs, three teaspoons of lemon zest, one teaspoon of Nielsen Massey vanilla extract, and two cups of sour cream. First, we will be making the cupcakes. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees while you make the batter. In a large mixing bowl, add the wholesome sweeteners, organic sugar, and softened butter or margarine. Blend these together until the mixture is fine and creamy. Next, beat in the eggs one at a time. Now mix in the Nielsen Massey vanilla extract and lemon zest. In another mixing bowl, combine all dry ingredients. Then, mix the dry ingredients in alternately with the sour cream, making sure to uniformly blend the batter. Prepare a muffin tray with paper muffin cups and fill each of them a third to a halfway full. Check that your oven has reached 350 degrees and place the muffin tray on the top rack. Let them bake for 25 to 30 minutes. While the cupcakes are in the oven, we are going to make the delicious creamy frosting that completes this recipe. For the frosting, you will need two and a half cups of confectioner's sugar, three tablespoons of softened butter or margarine, two and a half tablespoons lemon juice, one half teaspoon lemon zest, one teaspoon Nielsen Massey vanilla extract, and one tablespoon milk. As we did with the cupcake batter, add the confectioner's sugar and softened butter to a mixing bowl and blend them together until creamy. Add the rest of the ingredients and beat the mixture until it has a smooth consistency. Once you've removed the cupcakes from the oven, allow them to cool for around 10 minutes before frosting them. 
And here is the final product. Not only do they taste delicious, but they also give off a heavenly aroma that'll spark up your appetite whenever you enter your kitchen. In total, the batch produces around two dozen cupcakes. If you think that's a lot, think again, because they'll be gone before you know it. Well, I really hope that you enjoyed this recipe. For anyone trying it out, I suggest using organic sugar and natural vanilla extract. It really does make a difference in the taste. Happy cooking!